Linda Wood came for a new set of dentures. Really needed. Um, <laughs> without them, I felt like I was ugly. She got her first set of dentures about four years ago at one of these events until her dog sadly got a hold of them. When my dog got a hold of them, um, she, I just felt ugly. And um, I was so upset at her because I said, you're making me ugly. Ready? Beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> we were there when she finally got to see her new smile. It was beautiful. <laughs> they make me feel so much better. <laughs> Something I probably should have done a long time ago. And the dentists that have flown in from across the state to volunteer for this, well, they couldn't help but get a little emotional too. Words or money can't even express the amount of, uh, of, uh, appreciation I have for her for letting me work on her and uh, seeing her smile and glow. Like Wood, most people here are getting work done that they wouldn't normally be able to afford. I couldn't afford it, so I had to pay some kind of cash. You have to make a choice and a decision of what to do and what not to do. And sometimes there's great sacrifices with that. And for me, that's been, it's been my teeth. Valerie Reed is on disability, so things are already tight. And the last time she went to a dentist, she was scared away. My bill was $8,700. Today, though, it's a much different story. I had two broken front teeth, and now aren't they beautiful? Seven years after taking a big fall and cracking her two front teeth, her smile is finally complete again. My teeth don't hurt anymore. In Modesto, Lena Howland, ABC 10 News.